Uh, now let's talk about why business correspondence is important. And there's two main reasons here and some other categories that fall below that. So first of all, it's less costly than other means of communication. When you compare email to think the old times where you had to write a manual letter and then give that manual letter to the or the paper to the post office and then wait for the post office to deliver it and then wait for the other person to write you a letter and give it back. That takes a lot of time and it also takes a lot of resources. Why do that when you could just send an e write an email in two minutes and send it in less than two seconds, right? So again, less costly and it's much better than other forms of communication. The second, and in my my opinion, the more important one, is evidence and official record within and outside the company. So I think we've all at some point uh, had something like when you send someone an email, whether that's a coworker or someone, uh, say a customer, for example, and they come up with the excuse of, oh, I never got your email. Well, that doesn't really hold up anymore because you have evidence uh, an official record that says, hey, I actually did send you the email and here you go. As you can see, I have it or I have proof that I have sent the email on my part. Anything else is on you. You see, if you would have said that just orally, like, hey, I'm going to do this, this, this and that. And then the other person is like, oh, you never said that to me. You have no means of providing proof to as to, hey, uh, you actually said you were going to do this and that with me. But with written format, especially emails, there's evidence right there that shows that, hey, we actually talked about this and we just uh, we had a whole discussion about it. It also uh, speaking more about this category, it gives seriousness to the communication in and outside the company. Again, people tend to take you a lot more seriously when you give uh, email, when you write an email instead of just saying things uh, that you can't keep your word with. You know, so talking to your coworker is a lot different than actually sending them an email and including people. And finally, it maintains the professional image of the company. Again, a company has a certain professional image that it has to uphold and email uh, or business correspondence in general helps that.